Hello teachers, learners, and parents. Sir Jeff po at your service. Alam nyo ba na meron tayong website na tinatawag na DepEd Commons? Ang DepEd Commons ay binuo upang gawing accessible ang pagtuturo at pag-aaral dito sa ating bansa gamit lamang ang inyong mga smart devices gaya ng cellphones, tablets, at computers. Dito ay maaari nating ma-access ang iba't ibang learning materials mula sa Department of Education. Meron itong mga interactive materials, electronic self-learning modules, at instructional video lessons mula sa DepEd TV na tiyak na makatutulong sa pag-aaral ng mga mag-aaral galing ka man sa public o private school. Walang problema. Dahil welcome ang lahat dito. Para ito sa mga guro, magulang at mga mag-aaral mula sa kinder hanggang grade 12, alternative learning system o ALS, at pati na rin ang special education. At huwag kang mag-alala dahil kahit walang load ay maaari mong ma-access ang mga learning materials. Tama! Libre ito! Ang kailangan mo lamang gawin ay i-on ang iyong data at buksan lamang ang iyong browser at i-type ang commons.deped.gov.ph. Alam na ba ng iyong mga kasamahang guro o mag-aral ang tungkol sa DepEd Commons? I-share mo na ang video na ito upang matuto rin sila kung paano gagamitin ang DepEd Commons sa mabilis at napakadaling paraan. Muli! Ito po si Sir Jeff at kita-kits po tayo sa DepEd Commons. Paalam! Magandang araw, Sir Wilbur po at your service. Narito ang itulay upang gabayan ka sa inyong pag-aaral upang lubos na maunawaan ang iba't ibang paksa o subject. Ang itulay ay isang free online tutorial class na pinangungunahan ng ICTS Educational Technology Unit sa pumumuno ni Undersecretary Alain Del B. Pasqua. Ang programang ito ay hindi lamang para sa mga bata, kundi ito rin ay magsisilbing gabay sa mga magulang at mga guro kung paano nila ituturo o gagabayan sa bawat asignatura ang kanilang mga anak o mga estudyante. Sa kasalukuyan, ang self-learning module mula sa regyon ng Calabarzon at kilala sa tawag na pivot ang ginagamit sa ating itulay online class. Kaya ano pang hinihintay ninyo? Ihanda na ang inyong mga ballpen o lapis, papel o kwaderno at samahan kaming itulay ang pagkatuto para sa bawat batang Pilipino. Sama-sama tayong magtutulungan para malampasan ang mga hamon sa panahong ito. Halina't matuto kasama ang inyong online tutor sa oras na ito. Hello, hello! Good afternoon, kids! And sa lahat ng mga ating mga live viewers ngayong araw na to, uh, sa mga dear parents, teachers, hello, good afternoon po sa inyo. So, how are you today? Hmm, I hope you are all doing well. So, always safe and healthy. So, it is another day of learning with Tutor Jessa. So, we're going to learn in a fun, easy, and engaging way of learning. So, are you all excited? Yes, I'm also excited. But before that, okay, so let me greet. Um, sa mga taga, hello sa mga taga Isabella, thank you for tuning in last week Sa mga taga Ligay National High School, Ligay Elementary School, thank you so much Okay, so kids, na itulay na natin ang quarter 3 Yehey, congratulations sa atin We are now in quarter 4 and we are almost there So malapit na natin ma ma matapos ang taong ito, ang school year na ito So without... Further ado, so let me share you my screen. Okay, so hello, hello, good morning, uh, good afternoon, Carl, Nigel, and sa mga taga Francisco Benitez, thank you for always tuning in. Hello, good afternoon sa inyo. All right, so let's start. 
So welcome to Idolai Online Tutorial where everything is fun and educational. So I will be your tutor in English 1, Quarter 4, Week 1. And our lesson for today is all about action words. Wow, that's so exciting. Okay, so... Ayan. So before we start, I would like you to prepare the following pencil, notebook, or paper, modules, and your mobile phones or laptop, your mobile phones for taking a picture of yourself and then upload it. Okay, so I will tell you later the hashtag or we have the same hashtag. Okay, last week. Okay, so can you still remember our English class song? Okay, so if you do, then let's sing it all together. But I'm sorry, I nagka problema sa pag-save. So hindi ko na-update yung mga pictures na naandoon. So it's still, ang mga pictures na magagamit natin is yung picture pa rin natin before. So, ayan. Let's sing our English class song with an action. So are you ready, kids? So let me share another screen for that. All right, so let's sing it. It's oh, okay. It's time Ready. for the English class. Click, 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 clap, clap, clap. It's time for the English class. Click, 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 clap, clap, clap. The English class. The English class. All right, so that's all. Thank you for singing with me. So let's go back to our um, lesson. Ayan, so we are done with our English class song. Okay, so can you still remember this one? When I say, you say. So when I say, chica, chica, you say, let me hear it. Okay, let me hear this one. Chica, chica, you say, boom, boom. Good job. Okay, wow. Thank you, Precious, for saying boom, boom. You, okay, and Samantha, thank you so much. So let's have another one. When I say one, two, three, eyes on me, you say, again, one, two, three, Eyes on me. You say, good job, precious Sophia. One, two, three. Eyes on you. Wow, ang galing. Ayan, mga, mga masisipag ko talaga ng mga estudyante yung mga yan. Okay, so let's have again the Harris reminder to listen with your entire body, not just your ears, okay, but your whole body. First, your eyes looking toward the speaker, your ears, both ears ready to hear, your mouth is quiet, waiting for your turn, your hands quiet and kept to yourself. Your feet quiet and still, your body facing toward the speaker, and of course, your brain thinking about what is being said. And last but not the least, you should listen with a heart. Consider the speaker and others listening. Yay! All right, so at the end of our tutorial, you will be able to... Ayan, we only have one objective today. Recognize common action words in stories. Okay. Ayan, but before that, let us recall our previous lesson. So we, you are going to name the pictures. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Okay, so, but don't forget to write the number, number first and then your answer. Okay, so for, for number one, Hello, Julia, watching from Maligaya Elementary School. Hello. Okay, for number one, kids, I would like you to answer this one. What's in the picture? A, wake up. B, take a bath. Or C, study. Okay. 
I'm waiting for your answer. Ayan, may sumagot na from Althea and Precious. Okay, and Johan, eh, according to them, it's letter B. So let's see if your answer is correct. Okay, the correct answer is letter B. Good job! Okay, so let's proceed to number two. Okay, ayan. What's in the picture? Number two. We are in number two now, kids. Uh, good afternoon then, Althea. Watching from Antonio M. Serapio, SDO Valenzuela. Hello sa lahat ng mga taga Valenzuela. Okay, number two, letter C. Okay, most of you answered letter C. But uh, I can see letter B then. Okay, so letter C. But let answer this one. Okay, so the correct answer is letter C, brush, yet. Okay. Let's have this one. Number three. Talasa na mga mata. What can you see in the picture? Hmm. I'm waiting for your answer, kids. Ayan. Hello, Jazz. <laughs> Okay, so most of you answered letter C. Okay, so let's see. Hello, Kirsten. Letter C, precious. Sophia, Anna, letter C. Okay, so let's see if your answer is correct. The correct answer is letter C. Good job. Okay, let's have number four. Ayan. What's in the picture? Yeah, hey, what's in the picture, Kaya? A, B, or C. Do homework, play, or listen to music. Okay, so ang bibili sumagot. Hello from... Eto na, number four, according to Althea, Isaiah, Cynthia, Malu... Isaiah, it's letter A daw. Okay, so let's check if your answer is correct. So the correct answer is, Charan, it's letter A. Good job. Okay. Alright, so let's proceed sa ating Pagong lesson. But we are going to play first Simon Says. Alam nyo ba yung larong yan? Or are you familiar with that game? Are you familiar with Simon Says game? Okay, so kung familiar kayo, then good. But let me explain it that. Uh, let me explain it to you. So I am going to tell something to do. But you should only do it when Simon says so. So if if I say, for example, Simon says, touch your ears, then you should touch your ears. Okay? So, sasabihin ko muna ang Simon says. Okay? But if I just say, touch your ears, then you should not touch your ears. Kasi if you do, then you'll be out. Bakit? Kasi walang Simon says eh. Okay? So I just said, touch your ears. Okay? So dapat si Simon ang nagsabi, not me. Okay, let's have another example. Simon says, clap your hands. Then you should clap your hands. Okay? But if I just say, Clap your hands. Whoops. Don't clap your hands because you'll be out. Okay? Alright? Naintindihan ba yun, kids? Is that clear? Yay! Daw from Ross. Wow, excited na siya. Ayan. So, let's see. Let's see. Kung ready na nga ba ang lahat. So, first. Okay, opo daw, naintindihan daw ni Johan. Good job. Okay, so let's start the game. This one is exciting. Simon says, touch your nose. Alright, you should touch your nose. 
Simon says, wiggle your hips. Wiggle your hips. All right. Clap your hands. Whoops. Was anybody clapping? If you did, then you're out. Because I never said that Simon says clap your hands. So, oh, well, don't worry. It's just a practice. So, let's keep the game going. Ayan. So, are you still in or out? Okay. Ang sasabihin nyo lang sa akin is in or out. Okay. When you're out, then i-comment nyo, oh, teacher, I'm sorry, but I'm out. Okay. Eto na. Simon says, stomp your feet. Simon says, sit properly. Simon says, stand straight. Wave your arms. Oops. Did anybody wave their hands? Well, if you wave your hands, then you're out. Sorry, you're out if you wave your hand. So, who's out now? Oh, still in. Good job. Okay. So, let's continue the game. Simon says, snap your fingers. Simon says, scratch your head. Shake your hands. Oops. Did anybody shake their hands? Well, if you did, then sorry, you're out. So, all right. That's the end of our game. Sinong out? Sinong na-out dyan? Okay, no, no daw. <laughs> okay, hello, Sham. You're watching. Oh, si Johan daw na-out. Okay, well, that's okay, Johan. All right. Okay, so let's uh, let's discuss our lesson for today. So in our game, these are what Simon said us to do. Snap your fingers, touch your nose, stomp your feet, stand straight, sit properly, and wiggle your hips. Now, notice the underlined word. So Please, can you please read all the underlined words? Pakibasa nga or pakichat nga lahat ng mga underlined words na nakikita ninyo. So, let's see. Let's see. What are the underlined words? Mm -hmm. What's the underlined words? Hello sa mga Kingfisher. Oh, you're watching. <laughs> snap. According to Althea Aguilar, snap, touch, stomp. Stand, sit, and wiggle. Wow, you have the fastest finger, ha? Okay, I like that one. Okay, so na-comment mo lahat ng mga underlined words. All right. So that, those words are what we call action words. So what are action words? Or in Tagalog, salitang kilos. Okay, salitang kilos. So what? are action words. So, these are words that show movement. Alright? So, it refers to what we can do. Diba? Ginawa ninyo yung mga, mga sinabi ni Simon. Okay? So, those are action words. Okay, for example, the snap, touch, stomp, stand, sit, and wiggle. So, those are all action words. Okay? Yes, very good, Bri, Gabrielle. Those are action words. All right. Are words that show movement? Okay. Ang tiyaga naman ni Althea mag-type. Okay. So, let's continue this one. So, let's have learning task number one. Okay. So, you are going to complete the story. Choose the correct action words inside the box. Okay. But. You use the picture to guide you, okay? So, can you please read all the all the action words inside the box? So, let's read it all together, kids. Read, write, listen, sing, dance. Okay, so those are all action words, okay? So, listen to the story and look at the picture, ha? Okay. 
Hi, I'm Leo. I am six years old. I want to share the things that I can do. I can for number one. Ayan, that's the picture for number one. Ayan, I can. Ano daw ang nagagawa ni Leo? Number one, what's your answer? Okay, number one, I can sing. We are in number one, kids, ha? Okay, s s number one lang muna. Okay, never mind the number two. Later na natin yung sasagutan. Okay, for number one, ang sabi ni Althea is read. Huh? Is it read? Okay, dance, Jacob, sing. Ah, si Maria pala yung sumagot ng read. Okay. Sing, Kayla, Kay, Kaylay, and Sophia, and you all sing. And sing. Ayan. Alright. So, most of you answered sing. So, let's see if your answer is correct. I can sing. Good job. And this is the second picture. I can sing. And for number two... And blank well. Okay. What's the action word for that picture? Number two na tayo, kids. Number two. All right. According to Rowan, it's dance. Althea, dance. And Kirsten, dance. Okay. Hi, Shem. Okay. You forgot to write the number. Okay? Don't forget to write the number first and then uh, your answer, okay? So, the correct answer for number two is and dance well. Wow! So, let's have number three. I also blank stories in the books clearly. I also blank stories in the books clearly. Don't forget to write the number three. Okay, so number three is read. Okay, read. Most of you answered read. Kay Rowan, kay Lori May, kay Baby, kay Maricar, it's read. Okay, wow, I think you know this one. Okay, so I also read stories in the books clearly. Good job. Okay, let's have number four. I can blank my name properly. I can blank my name properly. What's the action word for that picture? Okay, number four, Samantha Wright. Chonaline Wright. Okay, read. All right. Most of you. Oh, maybe yung read is for number three. Okay. Ayan, very good. My number four na. Okay. Okay, so the correct answer for number four is right. Good job. I can write my name properly. And for number five, last one. I blank to my parents. I enjoy doing all of this every day. I blank to my parents. I enjoy doing all of this every day. So, what's your answer? Okay, number four, according to Shem, it's right now. And sa anak ni Ma'am Lea, listen number five. Okay, so we are in number four na, okay. Althea, listen. Jonalyn, listen. Precious, listen. All right, so most of you answered listen. So let's check if your answer is correct. Okay, I listen to my parents. I enjoy doing all of this every day. Yay, good job. All right. Okay, so once again, action words are words that show movement. It refers to what we can do. 
These action words are used to make a story or sentence. So here are examples of action words. So ito na yung mga examples ng action words. Okay? I will give you an action word and then you are going to use it in a sentence. So let's see kung kaya ninyo na ninyo mag-construct ng sentence. Okay? So number one is sleep. So the action word is sleep. So can you please use the word sleep in a sentence? Okay, so sino kaya? Yay, Riona! Wow, happy happy si Riona and Faustino. I sleep early, sabi ni Althea. I am sleeping in my bed, sabi ni Jonalyn. Wow, ang bibilis naman sumagot. Good job. I'm sleeping in my bed or on my bed. I sleep well. Precious Sophia, I sleep early tonight. So I'm not late at school today. Wow. Okay, I sleep every night according to Kirsten. Okay, I sleep very long. Wow, very long talaga according to, um, ayan, sa baby ni, anak ni Ma'am Leia. I forgot his name. Okay, pakilala ka nga. What's your name? The girl sleeps. Wow, good job, Shem. The girl sleeps daw. Okay, so she used... The picture. Okay, good job. You should use the picture. Okay. So, but my own sentence is, Lani sleeps well. But your sentences are also correct. Okay. So, let's have another one. The action word is play. Okay. Can you please use the action word play? Okay. Let's see. She is sleeping. Okay, we are in number two na, kids. Okay, play. Oh, Marco. Hi, si Marco siya. Okay. Okay, hello, Marco. Oh, kasi di ba mga account ng mommies ninyo or daddies ninyo yung gamit ninyo? Okay, so... Ayun, me and my friends play in the park yesterday. Wow, that's a great idea. That's great idea, Precious Sophia. I like that one. Okay, so let's have another one. Okay, Althea, good job. The children play, sabi ni Shem. And ayun kay Jersey, Joy and Joe are playing. Wow. Okay, I play after school. Sabi ni Elena Carpio. Ayan, I love to play with my friends. Annalisa Balansag. And Len Santos. The kids are playing. Wow, nice idea. Great ideas, kids. So, but my own sentence is, Mira and Lino play every afternoon. But your answers are all correct. Okay. Let's have another one. It. Okay, so can you please use the word it in a sentence? Okay, use the word it in a sentence. I play with my brother. Every weekend, humabol si Cecilio Miguel. Okay, Cecilio Miguel. Ayan, kung account ng mother ninyo or ng parents ninyo ang gamit ninyo, don't forget to write your name. Okay, or at the end or at the beginning of your um, of your answer. Okay, according to Lance, I eat vegetables. Jennifer, I eat fruits. Oh, hello, Isaac. So, according to Isaac, I eat apple every day. Wow. Ang gagaling gumawa ng mga sentences na mga ito. Ah. Ayun, I like this one. Me and my family eat all together every day, according to Precious Sophia. Good job, Precious. Nice idea. Okay, me and my family eat all together every day. Ayun na nga yun. Sagot na nga ni, Pre ni Precious yun. I want to eat banana for lunch. Okay. You want to eat banana for lunch, Kelvin? 
Okay. Yes, maganda sa katawan yung banana. I eat breakfast every day. Felicit. Ayun, si Hena Faye naman yan. Okay, good job, kids. But my own sentence is, we eat together. Okay. So, let's have another one. Dance. Oh, I like that. I like to dance. <laughs> Kahit parehong kaliwa ang kamay ni teacher. I love dancing. Okay, so can you please read, uh, use uh, the action word dance in a sentence. Oh, hello, Mac Prince. I'm eating bananas and apple every day daw. Okay, so humabol pa. Humabol pa sa eat. I love to dance. Okay, Kirsten, sorry, but your action word for your sentence is love, not dance. Okay, so, or you should say, I dance with my sister like that. Okay. I love to dance ballet. Mm -hmm. Ayun, FN doll. I dance every day. Okay, good idea. Uh, and I like, I practice to dance. Okay, but your action word for that is practice, not dance. Okay. I dance with, ayun, okay, tama tong sentence na to. I dance with my friends. Good job, Roz. Okay, my sister, mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. So, all right. Yan na yon. Okay na yon. So, my own sentence is, Rita dances gracefully. All right. So, next. Hello, Ja. My sister brother, my older brother loves to dance. Okay. But your action word for that is love. Okay. Not dance. All right. So, let's have another one. Sing! Yay! I also love to sing. Eh, kahit hindi maganda boses ni teacher, bakit ba? I love singing. Mm -mm. Pag pinapatulog ko si baby, I am singing. <laughs> okay, so you use the word sing in a sentence. Okay? I like to sing. Mm, no, that's not... Uh, Yun, okay, this one is good. I sing very well. I sing gracefully from Precious. Okay, ayan, I'm, I can sing in the stage. We sing Filipino song. Good job, Roz. Okay. Mommy sing in the bathroom every day. Yes, I also love singing in the bathroom. <laughs> okay. Paras kami ng mommy mo, Mirasol. Okay. Is that you, Mirasol? What's your name? Dolly sings gracefully. Wow, good job, Wang. The girl sings a song. Okay. I sing so good po, ma'am. Oh, really, Marco? Magaling kumanta daw si Marco. Sige, bigyan na, hinga natin ng, ng, ng sample yan. Okay. Okay, Dolly sings gracefully according to Gwyneth. Okay, si Gwyneth pala yan. Hello, Gwyneth. Okay, my own sentence is, she sings her favorite song. Okay, good job. Let's have another one. Okay, so tapos na pala tayo. So let's have a uh, learning task number two. So you are going to match the pictures in column A with the correct action words in column B. So write the letters of your answers. Okay, so write the letter only. Okay, for example, in column A, what's in the picture or what can you see in the picture? So, what is the right action word for that picture? So, you choose the answer in column B. Okay? So, I will be waiting for your answer, kids. Okay. So, for number one. Aha. Uh -huh, so, let's see. See, Mac Prince. According to Mac Prince, it's letter C daw. Abo, ang gagaling naman. Okay. Letter A daw. Ano ba talaga? Letter A. Pero ang nakasulat is swim. So, I think nalito lang siya. 
Uh, number one is swim. Okay. Hello, Ron Ivan Diatar ng Matiaga. Okay. Thank you, kids, for always tuning in, ha? Huh? All right. So the correct answer is letter C. Good job. Okay, so let's have number two. So that's the picture for number two. So what's your answer? Hmm, let me let me see your answers. Number two na tayo. For question number two, I'm waiting for your answer. Ayon, according to Kirsten, number two daw is letter B. And for Jairus, oops, natabunan, sorry. Ah, okay, wala pala siyang sagot. Watching daw from Francisco Benitez Elementary School. Hello, <laughs> thank you for watching. Ayun, letter, ayun, according to Bon Ivan Timbas, hello Bon, letter B. Okay, so let's see if your answer is correct. So for question number two, the correct answer is letter B. Good job. Okay, let's have number Three. Okay, for question number three, what's in the picture kaya? Okay, let's see. Number three. Watching from General Malvar. Hello, elementary school Manila. Hello, Sam. Hello, Maya. I hope you're watching. <laughs> and sa yung principal dyan. Hello, Sir Benji. Okay, according to Ron, it's letter D daw. And Isaac, letter D. And Mac Prince, letter D. Okay, so Isaiah is letter D. Hmm, ang bibilis nyo talagang sumagot. Okay, so the correct answer is... Let's check. Letter D. Good job. Okay, so next. Let's have number four. Okay. What's uh, the action word for that? Okay. Kay Lil John. Hello, Lil John. Ang number three niya daw is letter D. Okay. We are now in number four. Okay. Number four na tayo, kids. I'm waiting for your answer. Okay, so let's read your answers. Ayan, so according to Althea, again, it's letter E. Bark, Royce, Ivan, letter E. Oops, pero may sumagot ng letter D. Okay, si Shem, ang daming E. E, okay. And... Si Lil John, letter E. Okay, most of you answered letter E. Ayan, Precious, letter E. And Faustino, letter E. And Marco, letter E. Okay, so let's check if your answer is correct. Okay, good job. The correct answer is letter E. Very good. Okay, so let's have the last one, number five. Okay, for question number five. Ayan, that's the picture. So what's the what's the correct action word for that? Mm -hmm. So let's see. Let me hear. You, uh, let me see your answer. Okay, so Kai Wang, it's number five. Though is letter A. Wash. Okay. Ayan, number five is A, wash. Wow, good job. Okay. All right, ayan. Most of you answered letter A. Wow, let's check if your answer is correct. 
So the action word for this picture is letter A. Yay! So we are done sa ating learning task. Okay, so dahil meron pa tayong time, magbibigay ako sa inyo ng assignment. Okay, so yung assignment niyo, you're going to upload it on Facebook or pwede rin namang i-direct ninyong i-chat sa akin. Okay, so ilista nyo lang lahat ng kaya nyong gawin. Okay, the things that you can do. For example, if you can paint, okay, then it's better kung magpipicture kayo while you are painting. Okay, or if you can dance, then pwede ninyong i-video ang sarili ninyo while you are dancing. Oh, I love to watch that one. If you can sing, then i-video nyo rin ang sarili ninyo while you are singing. Okay? So, you write all the things that you can do. Okay? Is that clear? That's your assignment. All right. So, that's, the, that's all for today, kids. So, thank you for watching. Okay, so for comments and suggestions, you may email us at edtech at deped.gov.ph or you can upload your assignment and your pictures while you are watching or while you are answering our activities today with the hashtag English Time with Tutor Jessa. Okay, and or pwede nyo ring i-PM sa akin directly. Ang aking Facebook account is Chesa Tendido Danyo. Okay? So, ipapaalala ko lang ulit sa inyo yung assignment. The things that you can do. Okay? So, list all the things that you can do. So, that's all for today, kids. Thank you for watching and keep safe. Keep, uh, keep safe. Don't forget to pray. Okay? So, stay at home, dyan lang kayo sa bahay ninyo. So, enjoy and relax and keep on tuning in every Tuesday. Bye! Thank you so much! Sigurado ako na marami ka namang natutuhan sa ating itulay tutorial session ngayong araw. Tandaan, ito ay hindi lamang para sa ating mga mag-aaral, kundi pati rin sa ating mga minamahal na guro at mga magulang na kaagapay natin para maituloy ang pagkatuto sa kabila ng nararanasang pandemya. Patuloy ding sumubaybay sa DepEd TV para sa mga araling ginawang video episodes. Mapapanood ito mula lunes hanggang sabado, alas 7 ng umaga hanggang alas 7 ng gabi sa inyong mga telebisyon. Abangan bukas mula alauna ng tanghali ang iba pang aralin sa ating itulay free online tutorial session sa Filipino. I-like and subscribe at manatiling nakasubaybay sa ating itulay tutorial session sa DepEd EdTech Unit FB page at Educational Technology Unit channel sa YouTube at sa DepEd Tayo at DepEd Philippines social media accounts. Paalam!